Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Alice Richard and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix the problem with the table of content. So recently I, I encountered a problem while creating my table of content and this problem, it's the body of the text, the paragraphs showing in the table of content. And what do I mean by the text, the body of the text showing in the table of content? So I'm going to be using the automatic table of content by going to reference table of content and selecting the table of content here. And you can see that this table of content has appeared on my first page. However, if you look here, you can see this body of text showing in the table of content, which is not what you want. Also the table, which should be a caption, it's showing in the table of content. So when this type of problem happen, how do you resolve this? I'm going to show you a quick fix on how I rectify this problem. So this problem has to do with the styling that you've used in during your writing. And if we click on this text, the one that is appearing in the table of content, if you click on it, it will take you directly to where the text is in the, in the document. So just go to go back home and click on the style. So if you click on the style, like for instance, if I click on this one, you can see it's showing that it's a normal and bold, meaning this is not going to be even been appearing in my table of content. So I'm going to first rectify this problem by clicking it as a sub or subsection, and then going to the text, this one, it's appearing as a heading. And if you look at the body of the text itself, it's also appearing as heading and that's why there was a problem in the table of content generation. So I'm going to click this as a click a style for it. And this text that is appearing, I'm going to be clicking on it as a normal text. That way it will stop appearing in my table of content. So now let's go back to the table of content. You can see also the table of content did not display appropriately. You can see it's jumped some number but first let's update this table of contents by clicking here you click update table click on update entire table and click ok you can see that automatically the body of text that was showing in a table of content has disappeared and you can see that the numbering of the table of content the the section it's appearing in the right order however the well, some sections are missing from here. So if you're having such problem, just go back and check each of your text, like this one. It's showing that it's appearing as normal. Just define the, the numbering that you've created earlier. And in order to avoid having to do this one after the other, you can watch my earliest video that I recorded on setting up permanent style in Microsoft Word. And this will help you to avoid this problem because you can already do this as you're writing along for the purpose of this tutorial i tampered again with this table of content after i had a similar problem just to be able to show you how i rectify that so i'm just going to quickly redefine all this And this should fix the problem that I'm having with the table of content. This figure, it's showing as normal as well. It's supposed to be a caption. Just click on it as caption. That way it will stop showing. This is a sub, a sub. Okay, I think I will just stop right there rather than going through the whole text. And so I'm going to stop here. Then we can go and update our table of content. So this table of content, remember to always just click here and click update table. Remember to tick the update entire table. And that way you can see that now it shows more. However, it's still showing table. You don't want a uh, table in your table of content you can generate table of uh, you can generate a table of content for your figures your table separately 
So for this, in order to eliminate this table, the caption showing from your table of, of contents, you just have to go back to where that table is. So let's just click on this, so it takes us there. And this, if you check it, it's, you can see that it's showing as heading. You don't want to make the mistake of selecting the title of your table as a heading, rather select that it's a caption. And now if you go back to your table of content to update this, that should eliminate the, if you click this, you can see that it has eliminated the table, the caption of the table from showing the table of content. So you can apply this similar setting when you're generating your table of figures. Like now, let me, if I, okay, if you want to, don't delete table of content. However, it's best to just use remove table of content. So if you have problem with generating your table of figures or table of, of um, table of content for figures and table, you can apply the same setting that I've shown you in this today's video. And if you're having further troubles, you can please check in the, uh, write in the comment section. I'm happy to, to guide you through. Thank you for watching today's tutorial. If you find this useful, please subscribe to this channel to be able to get regular updates on similar content. And until next time, bye.